sending Mishloch Monas, if someone realized that he sent by mistake Mishloch Monas, that full of Shmita fruit, you know that it's forbidden to send Shmita fruit because it's called a Piron Chov. You're giving over something that you're obligated to give and you're not allowed to pay back something that's called making business with. So if someone by mistake realizes that he was giving Mishloch Monas and it's full of Shmita fruit, what does he do? So it's, it's not called that he gave Mishloch Monas and he has to give it again. He didn't do the mitzvah, he has to do it again. And of course, if someone sends Svichin, Isur Svichin, if it's grew by Jew on, in Eretz Yisrael, so it's Isur Svichin, and once in a while have an enjoyment out of it. If someone sent it to him and he realized that the Mishloach Monas was Shmita fruit or Svichin, so he has to send another Mishloach Monas. The first mitzvah, the first Mishloach that he did, he didn't. To the mitzvah. Now in Hebrew, Mi she shalach mishloach manot, the Petarur to Motze, she ufitom niska avu re she u shalach perot shvi. As u lo kiem et mitzvah she mishloach manot, the tzarich mishloach od pam mishloach manot. Chen oto davar im echad shalach mishloach manot, ve yasham asfichin. As u lo kiem et mitzvah, u tzarich mishloach od pam mishloach manot. Je crois.